guys, it is Shauna Kell and I want to welcome you to Wellness Wednesday. Let's talk about spring, enzymes, water, what do they all have in common? A lot. So I don't know about you guys, but sometimes when spring comes along, I start hearing people complaining about things like, oh my, um, my eyes are watering, my nose is running, um, all those things that aren't necessarily the fun part of spring, right? I want to enjoy spring. I want to enjoy the trees. I want to enjoy the flowers blossoming. So what can we do? Well, don't you love it when it rains and it just cleans the air? And when that rain comes down, it smells wonderful. It feels wonderful. It's refreshing. Water does the same for us. So here I've got my water right here. I've got my rubber bands and my little happy Care Bear. So when we drink water, that helps flush things out of our body. It keeps us nice and clean. So we want to make sure we're drinking enough water. But you might be saying, I drink a lot of water and I'm still having issues during the springtime. So let's talk about something else. Do you know what enzymes are? Because if you don't know what enzymes are, you might want to know a little bit more this spring to have the most wonderful spring ever. All right. So. Let me tell you, enzymes are important because they give springtime support, they love on your gut, and they help getting toxins out of your body. Now you might say, what does toxins have to do with it? I'm talking about what's in the air outside. Well, when our body is overflowing with toxins, it has a hard time taking care of those things that are outside, just being honest with you. So what happens, let's just talk about what happens, okay? When we bring things into our body, whether it be food or it be something out in the air and our body is having a reaction, it's because of the proteins, all right? Now we think of proteins as good, like, right? We need our fats, we need our carbohydrates, we need our proteins. But the thing is, is we need, our bodies need enzymes to break down those proteins. So really quickly, I'm gonna tell you something because I'm only gonna take a few moments of minutes of your time. When you eat a raw apple, it has the enzymes it needs to break down that raw apple. That's awesome, right? You cook that apple and you eat that apple, your body has to use its own enzymes to break it down, all right? Now, the more proteins that we have in our body that our body isn't breaking down, that turns into waste. And when we're not getting rid of that waste, we have issues, all right? So what do enzymes do? They help with breaking down food. They help with breaking down things that come into our body um, so that we can absorb it and get the nutrients from it. Now, I know that may be just a little bit of information and be a little overwhelming. So I want to let you know and invite you to um, tomorrow night. I am doing a spring into wellness class. Um, right here on Facebook. So you can go um, right here into the E3 Health events and click on that and click going and you're going to learn more about specific enzymes, Allerzyme being one of them, um, and some other enzymes. We're going to talk a little bit more about water. We're going to talk about fitness and how exercise helps and all kinds of things that we need to be doing this spring so we can have the best spring ever. So I'm inviting you and I hope to see you guys soon. Bye.